Hey, I'm Chris. This is AFA Addy Family Adventures, and today we're doing kind of a different video. Uh, if you're looking for Disney or adventure, I guess this could be a kind of adventure, but it's not. This is me showing friends how to make a simple emoji for their channel with GIMP or with Photoshop. So uh, we're going to start with GIMP because it's free and most people can get it real easily. And then we'll go on to Photoshop. So first, let me pull it up. All right, this is GIMP. All right, you have all your tools up here. You have your panels here. You have brushes over here. And this is where your layers will be. All right, so but we don't really need to mess with that because... We, we're just going to do something really simple. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to hit File. We're going to go to Open. And then we're going to find our image. We're going to find it. Right in, right there it is. Okay, so this is our image. And, uh, so uh, one of my friends, she has a channel where she does pirate stuff from like from Disney. So she likes Pirates of the Caribbean. So basically, this image is too big to be an emoji. So it just needs to be converted down, or need needs to be rescaled. So the easy way to do that, sorry, we want to go to image, and we want to go to not image. I don't know. I've been using Photoshop so much. Uh, scale image. Yes. So you want to go to image and then go to scale image. All right. When it brings up, it says width and height. All right. So the biggest you can use for emojis on YouTube is 42 by 42. We're going to type in 42. Then we're going to click this little thing over here, and it's going to click make the height 42. Then we're going to hit scale. There it is. It's scaled down to 42 by 42. So this is what the image is going to look like or as your emoji. All right. So then after you're done with that, you want to go up to file. You want to go to export as. And it makes it a JPEG. But PNG is usually better, so you just go on down here. I don't know if my head's in the way. But you hit select type file, and then you just go down and you look for, for PNG. Hit export. Of course, you want to have up, up at the top where you want it to go to and everything like that. So that's pretty easy. Uh, so right now it says it's going into my video file. So... That is how you would make your emoji on GIMP for your YouTube channel. All right, I'm gonna show you how to do it on Photoshop. Okay, now we're on Photoshop. It's basically the same technique, just a little bit different. So, well, not really, practically the same. So here's your tool, your toolbox here. Uh, over here, you have your panels and everything, and down here is where your layers would be. All right, so we want to go to File. We want to go to Open. It brings us, it actually opens up your folder, unlike what it does on GIMP. We want to go down and find, there he is. All right, so there. So we want to make this into an emoji for your YouTube channel. So we've already got this in here. So we want to go to image, just like on GIMP. And you want to go to image size. Again, 42 by 42. Hit OK. All right. So there, there's what your emoji will look like. And then you go to file. Go to export, go to quick export as PNG. So it's automatically going to make it a PNG for you. Not like GIMP where you have to go switch it yourself. It'll automatically make it a PNG for you. Click on that. 
and change the name as file name and everything like that. And then it'll save you right into your files and then you can move it in to YouTube to use as an emoji. So it's real simple if you're just using just, you know, pictures or uh, images. But a lot of times, uh, if the image isn't quite square, you're going to have to probably crop it down because you're going to want a square image because it's 42 by 42. Anything that you make that's 42 by 42 that wasn't originally a square image, it may distort it. So remember that you might have to crop it down so it's a square image. But yeah, that's pretty much it. It's not that hard. It's really easy. So just got to remember you're working with pixels. If inches pops up, you want to switch it to pixels. So it's 42 pixels by 42 pixels. And then hit your buttons, you automatically have your image, your emoji right there. So uh, this is something I'm going to do for a little while each week. But uh, I wanted to show you how to make emojis for your channel if you're just using just regular images that you find. So I hope this helped you out. I hope to catch you on the next video. So we'll see you then. Bye.